Connecting Central Texas. This is 25 News. Good evening, I'm Lindsay Lippman. Here's a look at your top stories. Early voting is in full swing as voters in West head back to the polls to decide on whether to pass a $21 million bond measure for a new elementary school. Voters rejected a similar proposal last November by a slim margin of just over 60 votes. If voters approved the bond, the 81,000 square foot facility would be built on a 30 acre lot behind the newly built high school and West ISD's tax rate would increase. Bond issues for Gatesville ISD and Midway ISD are also on the ballot this year in McLennan County. A teenager is in critical condition after a shooting outside a Colleen McDonald's. Officers rushed to East Rancier Avenue just before noon after dispatch received a slew of 911 calls. The 18 year old victim was airlifted to Baylor Scott and White as police began to track down a suspect. Thanks to a solid description of the suspect, police were able to make an arrest in just about 20 minutes. Very little is known about what sparked the argument. Colleen police said the suspect and the victim knew each other before that shooting took place. Now it's time for a check on your first alert 25 forecast with Matt. All right, thank you, Lindsay. Temperatures will be into the low 80s on Wednesday, but changes on the way as we head into Thursday. Looks like a chance of thunderstorms across the region, especially by the afternoon and evening hours going into Friday morning. That will bring with it a strong cold front. So highs in the 70s will go down into the low 60s on Friday. Lows at night returning to the 40s and with gusty north winds, it'll feel colder than that. Weekends looking great, though, with highs in the 60s and 70s.